Welcome to Cretone Entertainment. I'm Chris. I'm Bree. And this is the only Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remaster streaming, not streaming, YouTube playing series ever where a wife forgot her husband's anniversary. Yep. Guys, our anniversary, this is coming out on Friday the 15th. Our wedding anniversary is Sunday and Bree forgot. I did. Life has been... She remembered about two hours ago. I did. So, there's clearly only one solution. We play Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remaster and we drink our caramel whiskey again. Yeah. No ASMR today. Just a little, uh, little ice jingling. Mm. I'm going to eat cheese balls while she plays too. It's going to be crunchy and loud and annoying. Um, yeah. Oh, God, that's so good. All right. To the Mount Golag Volcano. What's it called in this one? A go 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 go. It was Golag Volcano previously. Golg? I think it's just I think Golg. It's Golg. To new names. <laughs> to adventure. Going into Volcano. This is probably going to end in tears for me. Oh, it looks cool. There's so much lava. Oh, it looks so much cooler than you does, used to. Does the lava hurt me? She's ball crunch. Ow. Can I walk in the... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah. Ow. <laughs> ow. Ow. Okay. It's not great. <laughs> ah. Oh, and I found lava monsters. That's no, Those are not lava monsters. All right. We are going to uh, attack... But we are going to come down to the Ogre Mage. I hope these cheese, okay. cheese puffs are really distracting. I mean, they're distracting because they're delicious. Now, it's those Ooch cheese balls, guys. The, the ones you get for like $5 at Walmart, but we bought them for like $9 because we bought them at a liquor store. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Kind of whiskey real good, but it'd be really good with some Diet Coke. It would be. Guys, I stopped drinking regular Coke. Hmm? Huh? Mostly for the sugar reason. And now I actually like the taste of Diet Coke. I mean, there's there's that. I Actually, I think Diet Dr. Pepper is too sweet now. Yeah. Uh, no, that, was no, like no. Our, that was like our transition drink. Yeah. yeah Diet Dr. Pepper. I, I see. I still like the Diet Dr. Pepper, but you know which one is the money when you can find it? What's that? Diet Cherry Coke. I was going to say uh, Captain Jack. I mean, Jack, Jack is always... But not Captain Jack. I want a cheese ball. Ah! This is good streaming where we're eating cheese balls. Yep. Guys, ah! guys, ah! If, you're, guys if you're eating cheese balls, send us a message. It's going really well for you. It's going horribly. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got another ogre mage. That's an easy fight. Easy fight. Preemptive strike. So we had a buddy who lives in Finland now. We mentioned him on another video. Um, have mentioned when, we, when we made fun of, uh, actually, I think it was in uh, the most recent uh, Cretoni nap time. We made fun of our buddy because he was from Ohio and he moves in Finland. Um, he's a good guy. Um, he has good people. He ordered the infamous Captain Jack mm -hmm. years ago when he lived in uh, the the hellhole that is Florida with us. Florida? No, God bless it. Gajabunga. into the lava. Hey, can I let you know a secret? Lava. The, the lava damages you every step you put through it. Yeah. But there's no encounters in the lava. Oh. And it doesn't damage you much. I think it's like one for every step. Uh, but anyway, our buddy Alex uh, was not a drinker when we met him. And we're not huge drinkers either. Actually, we we have drunk more recording episodes for this channel than we probably have in the last two years. That is true. And that's not an exaggeration. That's kind of strange. Anyway, I'm going to drink some more. Fire Hydra! It's a fire hydrant. It's a fire hydrant. <laughs> I'm fighting a fire hydrant. Ah, uh, boo. <laughs> um, fight, fight. So he, so oh, he wasn't, oh, that died quickly. He wasn't a drinker, but he was also the type of guy who didn't like to admit that he wasn't a certain something ever. Yeah. Ow, and monsters! It, it monsters everywhere. It, and it didn't matter what it was. It, it, he, he wouldn't admit, you know, I, I don't know if he could or not, but he wouldn't admit if he couldn't parallel park. He wouldn't admit that he wasn't a drinker. So we would go out. I still can't parallel park, but I'll own that. So we would go out, and uh, my idiot friend Lance would regularly order, uh, like, a Jack and Coke. Oh, that's not a bad update for Red. No, that's not bad. So my idiot friend Lance would, like, regularly order, like, a Jack and Coke. I would regularly order, oh, like, a, a Captain and Coke with, uh, you know, like, a splash of sour or a splash of lemon or something. And Alex would sit there and listen to us, and he went out drinking with us one night, and he thought he was going to just be one of the guys and be really cool. And uh, the the server who we called Sarge, I don't know what his real name was. We just called this Not guy cool, Sarge. But Sarge is amazing. Sarge was a cool dude. So we're over at Nail House, uh, rest in peace, because they turned into a family restaurant. And it's terrible now. It's not great. Um, our pool tables are gone, and 
me playing endless scores of Bon Jovi on the jukebox is gone. But anyway, Alex and his supreme confidence. Look at these. They're doing these. They these are. Ankegs, these are. which used to be called peds, are really working you over here. Yeah, you're not. It's my you life need, is you need, not cool. You need to stop yeah. and heal. I am. But look at that experience. That, ooh, that was good. And cutie pie. <gasps> I finally have two that they weren't leveling up together, but now I oh, have wow, two, they, two. Oh, oh, look at that. <laughs> anyway. Now so, listen to the ASMR of somebody getting beat down because he decided to be a smart aleck. Every married man who watches that heard that stare. <laughs> you all heard it. You know you did. Gary, call me with those Texas divorce attorney's phone numbers. <laughs> you gonna need it. Go need it. Speaking of which, we need somebody to come on for future episodes of the Katrina Nap Time. We have not been pursuing that as uh, diligently as we should have. We uh, contact us through the comments or through the email and uh, Twitters and things. Yep. And yep. the Discord. We have a Discord. Join the Discord. I don't know what the link is. You haven't had that much to drink yet. How are you? I've, it's been a long day. It's been a, Ooh, long, it's been a really long day. So we're, we're recording this the night before it goes up. And I had a ridiculously long day at work today. And then I did a bunch of work when I got home. Be oh, no. Oh, you forgot to heal. I forgot oh, to oh, heal. Oh, you got to pull out your biggest spells and hope you live. Or cure right now. Or biggest spells. Or biggest spells and cure. All right. All right. All oh, right. Oh, get cure get Aga on, on Olivia immediately. Yep. And your biggest spell? What's your biggest spell on Cutie Pie? You've got you've got Quake now. You've I do got have quake. quake. Use Quake. It's funny. It probably won't work, but it's funny. Do it. Okay, Kiraga went first. Woo! So anyway, in Alex's uh, infinite wisdom. supreme inability to admit. Oh yeah, I fell into Earth. Yeah, boy. Oh well, yeah. I got all right. Yeah, all right. All right. Oh, I love Quake. Don't auto. Don't auto battle. I am not auto battling. <laughs> so in his infinite wisdom. He looks confidently at Sarge, and and uh, I ordered my my Captain and Coke as per usual with a splash of sour. Actually, I think I ordered an amaretto. No, you, yeah, you ordered a decent on her own Coke because it's a much girlier drink, which I was hundred percent on board with. Yeah, um, and then uh, Lance ordered his his. I forget what Lance ordered. I don't think it was his whiskey and Coke. But Alex looks at Sarge as confidently as somebody could look at somebody, and says, "I'll have a Captain Jack." And oh, bless Sarge's heart. He just he didn't even miss a beat. He didn't even miss a beat. Now, mind you. This story is way funnier if you know the Ale House. They had a dessert called a Captain Jack at the time. It was basically a piece of cake. It was some kind of weird thing to do with cake. It's like a banana coconut so, nut. It was delicious. So without missing a beat, Sarge looks at Alex and goes, So you want I should like throw that in a blender or something? And uh, it was it was glorious. That was actually a really bad story. That story's not great for telling people who don't know any of these people involved. Although a couple years later, when Alex and uh, Lance and I went to Gen Con, uh, Lance scouted ahead in a uh, sports bar in front of us and ordered a Captain Jack for uh, Alex. Mm -hmm. So when we walked into the table, um, I had gamer juice waiting, and Lance had gamer juice because that's what we do. Uh, you missed the chest. I missed a chest, but I'm going to these two chests. So a Captain Morgan and Jack Daniels combo shot was <gasps> sitting on the table, <gasps> and and bless his heart, Alex drank it. It was because it, it was an expensive shot. Uh, well, yeah, because <laughs> well, because it was actually four shots. Lance did a double on each. That that is that ain't a cheap shot, man. Ooh, I got some more money. And I so we haven't monsters. we haven't heard from our idiot friend Lance since he got married. Probably never hear from him again. Especially if he ever stumbles on this. Well, I sent him a trolling uh, picture. I the trolling picture. Because mm -hmm. we were, we uh, Alex came to town and we went out to actually the ale house. Why did we do that? Uh, to because get to it's get a the couple... only bar that was open. That's because... true. All the bars are closing out at like nine around here yeah. because of COVID. That's right. So anyway, we go to the ale house with him and uh, we're having a couple of drinks and that's when we see a notification on my phone that says that was the same day six years ago that the three of us were going to Gen Con. A photo yep. popped of us, of us in Kentucky. So they Alex and I... Fire, so, those yes, they do that. So Alex and I took a selfie and sent it to Lance and being like, oh, six years apart. And oh Lance no, never cutie pie, cutie pie, live girl, live! I'm going to stop talking about drinking buddies now. Uh, unless you're my friend Alex or my idiot friend Lance, reach out to Cretonia Entertainment. We'd love to have you on a Cretonia nap time. Magic. But back Magic. Back, to the, back to the fight. Back to action. Back to action! We keep eating these cheese, cheese ball ASMR right here. Mmm, cheese balls. Just, oh, stop. if you want to get your own 
uh, Oots cheese balls. They're those bright orange ones. Like I said, they have the, the purple cap and the oh, yeah. they're like in the gallon size jug, like five bucks at Walmart or like nine bucks at a liquor store. You can also get them online. Um, just Google cheese balls. No, Rule don't. Di- oh. mm. <laughs> it's the gift that keeps on giving. It's not. You're doing a lot of backtracking here. I am doing a lot of. I I'm not finding. Oh yeah, yeah. You know what, Kur- Kurag is not. Yeah, you know, it's not uncommon to have to leave. I don't uh, understand the volcano and heal up and then come back. I in. don't. That you are saying it's, it's not uncommon. You're saying it's not words. uncommon. You might want to actually consider doing it after you finish in here. You're you're saying words, and I don't. Uh, I don't understand them. It's, it's really weird. I, you're saying things. And excuse me. For or you have a cottage. You can literally just step outside and use a cottage. Because you're only in the first real room. This goes much deeper. I mean... Like, balls deeper. I'm right there. Everybody's feeling a little bit better now. What is the measurement on balls deep? Is, I'm it, not... is it a unit of measurement or is it a unit of effort? If it's a unit of effort, how many, like, newtons worth of force is balls deep? Now I'm contemplating this. Thanks. This is where I'm at tonight now in my day. I'm now contemplating how if it is a unit of measure or a unit of distance. I think it's a unit of time. It's how much time you've put. So I think, okay, how about this? It is a combination unit of time. You gotta hit the button. Stop wagging your finger. That's bad radio. I'm eating cheese balls. <laughs> it is a combination uh, unit of time and measure. Okay. And and effort. Guys, she's doing the work for me. I did not go ball deep on my effort. I did. If she had said what kind of measurement of time is it, I would not have had an answer. <laughs> I, I see. This is what happens. I'm not. I'm not that far out of being uh, back in school again. So now I'm like sitting here going, "Well, actually, I, well, well, I got a great story." You're finding all this crap, and you're not equipping. I, I really like the movie Back to School with Rodney Dangerfield. Uh, I, you know what? I, I hate to say this, but it was a lie. That was not what it was like going back to school. Uh, were you a millionaire? Was it toy mogul, fashion mogul, clothing mogul? What was he a mogul of? I don't remember. Uh, I don't rem- great sword. Great sword. It's effective against giants. This sword used to be called the giant sword. I feel like this is a missed opportunity here. Let's just see what it would do. You also have a great axe. So the Mithra Axe is 3747. Yep. And the great axe is not great. It's and boom. the great sword is it's more accurate, but it's less damage. Maybe yep. see what it does on Van Jack. I'm thinking about it. But I wanted to So I really like Back to School. I really like that Kurt Vonnegut was in it. That was a good movie. Uh Dax is in it. Da- that's true. Dax is in Dax it. Dax is in it. What? Dude, I got a great sword. You have, so, the, you have yeah. the best option on you right now. Okay. So uh, Dax is in it. That was always fun. Um, but you know what else was a good movie? Um, I was hoping you would know what I was thinking because I, I forgot. I, I don't. I, forgot. I don't. Okay. See. So uh, still not a great. Still not a great. Uh, not a great step up. I forgot what I was going to say about the other great movie. You sound another great I, movie. I like Hunt for Red October, but that's not relevant to what we're talking about at all. That uh, at all. He, I don't, I don't, I don't want to deal with you, Pyrolisk. You just uh, okay. Just. Uh. I'm really thinking about what that was, and I can't remember. Hey, okay. smack, smack, smack. Yes, everybody kills something. Do do do. E e e e e e e e. Mm. Dead oh. end. Oh. Yeah, the encounter rate is really high in this game. Yeah, it is. This is. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh that was. That was nothing. Okay. That was a. Uh, hey, Bree. Yeah. It's garbage. You might say it was hot garbage. I. Oh God! I need more, more, more cheese balls. Mm-mm. Oh. I feel uh, vindicated in eating cheese balls and goofing off in these videos because nobody watches them. You'd figure we'd be trying to improve and getting people to join the channel. Nah. I'm just leaning into the fact that it's just a terrible YouTube channel. <laughs> I mean, we're not terrible, though. We're pretty bad. Are we that bad? We're not, we're not great. I thought we were okay. I thought we were okay. There are some people who say we're okay. Thanks, we're over. A, we're say- over a year in and we're still sub-100 subscribers. Now, I don't know if that's good or not. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't feel good. You know what it is, though? You and I are not truly using this so much as a get-rich-quits theme. 
That is. Can you get rich quick on YouTube? Uh, there, there. I mean, um, actually, this was just an excuse for me to play with a video editor again. I don't do much with it, but it was just well, that was terrible. Yeah, it was. I just used an excuse to do that. Stop hitting me with fire! But I like it that you want to hold me. Hold me, horned devil. Hold me, hold me. Is that a song? Hold me, yes. All right, it's by uh, Nope. The, uh, oh Lord, help us. Eric Bana. Wait, he's an actor. Yeah, yeah, he is. I like Eric Bana and Troy. Uh huh. Eric Bana's in Troy, right? Troy's a really good movie. It's long, but it's a really good movie. You should heal. I should heal. Shouldn't. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nerds. <laughs> um, dink, 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 dink. Can, can you sort your inventory? You can sort your inventory. You know that, right? I did not. I had not looked at that. Like, you haven't looked at the button that says, You sit on the right hand side of the computer screen while we play the game. It's nope. on your side of this. Look at that. Look how helpful that was. That was super <laughs> helpful. Hey, remember when I was giving you grief for only buying 40 high potions? Yeah. I was trying to be helpful. Yeah. I see mm. that now. First party member to break 500 hips. Yep. Hip pop. So 500 HP in the original game would have been an absurdly high number. You probably would have been like level 12 or a 13. Bajillion. Like 12 or 13 coming into here in the original. They have definitely tweaked the amount of experience you get playing this game. And Van Jackman's about to die too. How do you not... How did I not see that? No, Van Jackman lived! How, <laughs> how do you not look at your HP? You do this in, in other games too. You know, I have a little sister. And she did not know how to read a clock. A digital clock. This is not... A super criticism. She's supposed to be smart. Um, she didn't know how to read a clock. She, for the longest time as a kid, would only look at the first number on a clock. So if it was like one fifty-seven, and you were like, "Hey, what time it was?" You know, what, you know, what time it was? What time you at? What time? <laughs> what time? Where? Who, where, who that time be? What time? Where art thou? <laughs> at last, poor York. Oh, we got snorts. We got snorts. Those are not my snorts. Guys, my wife snorts, and she forgets my anniversary. It's our ninth anniversary, she's forgotten it. Wait, what's the traditional gift of a ninth anniversary? That's right. I'm going to fight this anyway, guy now. It'd be like 157. She'd go, it's 1 o'clock. You'd be late for everything if you followed her time reading skills. Would you be late for everything, or would you be not I have unlike an, Gandalf? I have an older sister, too, who couldn't read an analog clock until she was 17. Yep. Well, I'm glad we had boys then. That's all I'm throwing out there. Oh my, look at all the chests! Is this would be the armory. Okay. Mithril gloves. gloves. Don't open the menu. Don't mm. open the menu every time. Just get the, get the whole room. That's, that's what I was going to do. Uh -huh. No, you, well, you were now, because I, I told you to. Uh, I don't think that's actually true at all, but I mean, whatever makes you feel better. Ah, monsters! monsters. Oh, real monsters. Ooh, that's a lava worm. I like how he's drooling. Ah. Ah. I killed him. Killed him dead. Ha 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 ha. But do, do, do. Ooh, and I got to just drop one of these cheese balls. They're really good. I'm not going to stop. I wish I had chicken wings. Chicken wings would have been real good tonight. I like chicken wings. I like chicken wings from Hooters, but I don't like Hooters girls. They creep me out. I think the restaurants in general I don't are... like their costumes. Ooh. Their costumes creep me out. I don't get booty shorts. Ah, real monsters! I don't understand them. I, I, You are obviously talking to the right person about that, because I also do not get them. Like, one of my favorite things to have for a football game is, like, ordering a tray of Hooters wings and having them, because that breading is just awesome. Got some money. Got a shield. Got an axe. Got a phoenix down. So, so before you walk away, look below you. Yeah. You have only come like 15 steps from the staircase but, that got you here. But, I, but I've already hit a you've bunch cleared, of these you've areas. The, you've cleared this area. This is why I'm pitching that it wouldn't be a good idea to step outside, use a cottage, and come back in. Because you've barely gone in here yet. And it gets deeper. It's not great. And remember, you can walk through the lava. Lava! You take a little damage. Not much. And you have no encounters while you're in there. I wish I could walk through the lava walls. I don't think those are supposed to be lava walls. I think they're supposed to be really hot walls. <laughs> That's a really good looking wall there. Some, some like a hot walls. <laughs> but I'm a man. I don't care. 
That's a good movie. Yeah, it's a good movie. <laughs> Ouch! Guys, if you haven't Ouch! seen Some Like It Hot, I know it's like, spoiler alert, okay, it's a brand new movie. <laughs> go, go, go watch it. It's a delightful film. It's, it is. Or, or, and also Doctor Strange level, or How I Learned to Stop. Yep. Uh, stop worrying and learn to love the bomb. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, I like classic black and white movies. I don't really watch them much these days. I did when I was younger. When I was younger, I used to watch a lot of them. These days, I don't have time to sit down and watch any movie, really. Oh man, we're filming this on Thursday night. It's the season finale of Star Trek Lower Decks. Oh, that makes me sad. Oh, I'm off work tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. we forgot I was off work tomorrow. She's made plans. This is, I, this is going really I, well. For, I, you did I, 500 and something damage with Olivia Newton-John there. Yes, she did. She's, she's got chills. They're multiplying. She does have chills, and they are multiplying. Guys, I've seen people defend Grease as a movie, and it's un, it's indefensible. It's not indefensible. It's just I'm going to throw a cheese ball at you. I would if they weren't so delicious. <laughs> Should I use a tent, a cottage, or a sleeping bag? Well, cottage bag? fully restores everything. I shall use a cottage. You got two. You have money, you should buy more. Oh, look at your little cottage. Tink -tink, tink -tink, sheep -sheep. You do a tent, it pitches a tent. Oh. It's not a, you might want to save before you go back in. I, I absolutely am going to save. Bree's not food. good at the not saving. No. Bree's no. good at dying. I'm great at dying. Get busy saving or get busy dying. I wish I could say Bree fought the good fight. I wish I could say she took on the monsters of the five volcano and won. But that just wouldn't be realistic. I like the lava because it, there's no monsters. I don't like the fact that, you know... I'm... I'm... Wait, wait you're kind of the host of this episode. you got to keep the commentary going. I know. I'm, I'm Tell sorry. Tell us what I... you're thinking with your strategy of hitting A to win. <laughs> Actually, I didn't hit A to win on that one. Well, there's no A. We're using a PlayStation controller. I know, circle well, to win. Yeah, I'm hitting circle to win, but I hit circle You just looked at the controller to see what button you're hitting to win. I, I did. <laughs> oh, this is why we don't have a lot of commentary or like a lot of people watching this because they're like, "How is this chick this old and she hasn't played video games before?" She's played video games before, just minorly, minorly. We're a fake geek girl trope. I, that's a terrible trope. I think that's a stupid thing. Everybody who says fake geek girl should have their teeth knocked out <laughs> yeah. by a by a goat. Screaming goat. A very angry screaming goat. Guys, watch Muppet Haunted Mansion. It's, oh, yeah, watch Muppet Haunted Mansion. It's really Jazz. good. And it's it so was, funny. And it was written and directed by the same guy who flipped uh, the bird to Captain Kirk in Star Trek IV, uh, The Voyage Home. Should we start showing Julian those movies? Um. Well, considering... Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, uh, there's a whole commentary here I am coming. A, I am a Trekker. Yes, you are. 100%. Absolutely. I don't know what a trekker is versus a trekkie. I've always personally thought a trekker is somebody who prefers the 24th century over the 23rd century. That's my personal definition. <sighs> Collectively, the first six Star Trek movies are not great. One is terrible. Yep. It's like 37 minutes wrapping around the Enterprise because Gene Roddenberry had a major hard-on for the new model. Can you blame him, though? Well, it's probably the first hard-on he had in a while. Oh, don't be mean to that. That's not mean to him. That's mean to Majel Barrett, who wasn't getting any at that point. That's, but, that's not nice to Majel. She is the mother. So, the motion picture is bad. The pajama film and the plot is bad. It is. It's bad. It is just bad. I've I've seen people defend it. And be like people make fun of it just because the pajama suits. It's actually really good. No, it's it's bad. Uh, Star Trek Two: Wrath of Khan is good. It's not great. <gasps> you shut your. Hey, I got what's, dark. What's good about Wrath of Khan? Uh, Mercado Montalban. Khan. That's it. And it's not even, it's not even the actual performance he gives. It's no, it's not, so cheesy. It's, it's <laughs> not Khan's performance that makes Khan. What makes Khan great it's is the, the it's, same thing that made Ewan McGregor's Obi Wan Kenobi great. It's the memes. It is the memes. It's the memes that come out of Star Trek Two that make Star Trek Two great. Star Trek Two is good. It's not great. You have Star been and always shall be. Star Trek Three should be an episode of Rick and Morty since Doc Brown is in it. Um, I'm not, I'm, you can't just Star Trek 3 has a major ethical dilemma for me because uh, Ooh, Scotty up. sabotages Excelsior eh. when Excelsior is trying to eh. activate its transwarp drive, right? Yes. It's implied 
that Starfleet gave up on the transwarp drive thinking that was a failure. Scotty set the Federation back a couple hundred years right there. I mean... That's problematic. James doing. What are you doing, man? Doing what, what he is needs James doing? Like you stepped out of the lava. I did step and out of the and lava. immediately got the fight. Yep. Star Trek IV The Voyage Home is a delight. I love it. Is a, it is a, a little del- computer. It is a delight. And you know what's funny is that the funny parts of Star Trek IV are not what I think is the funniest line of the movie. I think the funniest line of the movie is where Kirk is selling his glasses. You can check your map before you walk. I know. I was actually about to. I think the funniest part of the movie is when Kirk is selling his glasses. And it's low key funny. Now, dead ends don't mean no chests. I know. I, I know. Uh, so your path, you've got a dead end straight below you, mm-hmm. and then you make a loop if you go to the left. You'll make a big loop, and the staircase is on a dead end. As well. So the low-key funniest line of the movie is when Kirk has to sell his glasses to get enough money for them to go be Star Trekking across uh, San Francisco. Yes. And Spock looks at him and says, Admiral, weren't those a gift from Dr. McCoy? And Kirk responds... And that's the beauty of time travel. They will be again. <laughs> that's the funniest line of the movie. It, nobody gives it. Nobody gives it credit, but it's the funniest line of the movie. It, it comes and goes so nope, quickly. That's a good up there. But it's it's good stuff. Star Trek Five. Yes. What does God need with a spaceship? That's all I have to say. And then, what does God need with a spaceship? Star Trek Six is a decent wrap up, but the story's not great. Is that the one with the where the moon where- explodes? And the, the is that the one with where we have to deal with all uh, the assassin, yeah, for the Klingon Chancellor. Yeah, yeah, and you have the whole opening scene where they were just beginning to use true computer graphics. Yep, and Kirk is super racist in that movie, and he doesn't actually learn anything. He just kind of goes, "Well, I guess I'll be less racist for the future." Then he just gets trapped in a nexus anyway. So what does it matter? Star Trek Generations, I really enjoyed. People give it a bum's rush. They say it's not very great. Oh, I got a tent. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed Data's little singing and dancing. I enjoyed Michael McDowell being Michael McDowell. I enjoyed Captain Kirk on flying through the air on a bridge and getting smashed under it. Uh, oh, it's funny. First Contact is just brilliant. We know that. I this see. has become a thing. I'm yeah, talking about yeah. Star Trek movies here. Insurrection, uh, it's got its moments. It has its moments. But it's mostly for the memes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I... Uh, probably my favorite line in the movie comes really early where Picard has that realization moment where he figures out oh, how to stop. don't catch sleep! Oh, no! Okay. Oh, no! He has that realization uh, at the beginning of the film when they're trying to catch the renegade Data and he looks at Worf because they're in the captain's yacht going down. Yeah. Or not the captain's yacht, they're in that shuttle. They go in the captain's yacht later. And he goes, um, Worf, do you know Gilbert and Sullivan? Hmm. And Worf looks him dead in the eye and goes... I have not had a chance to meet all the crewmen since I've come back on board. <laughs> it's my favorite line of the movie. Favorite line of the movie. Do you think ice will work well since they all live in a fire area? I think there have been worse ideas in life. I'm going to try it. See how it goes. Star Trek Nemesis also had its moments. The Enterprise fighting the Scimitar was cool looking as hell. Yes. I Just firing that. stuff in all directions, trying to find them. Ooh, level up. Level up. Level up. Wasn't great, but it was level. I need to cure some people. And the Enterprise ramming into the Scimitar was cool. All right, I'll do that. sad. Star Trek 2009 was awesome. Lens flares be damned. In Lens flares be damned. It was... Into Darkness... It's a better take on it. It's a better take on the con Here story. Here we go. Here we go. is going to woefully disagree through blind loyalty. I am loyal to them cheekbones. I am loyal to them Benedict cheekbones. Benedict dragged down the film. <gasps> he did. Gary, call me with them numbers. He dragged down the film. We're going to need those numbers. Otherwise, I really enjoyed the film. I really enjoyed Beyond. Loki, what are you doing? We have a cat named Loki, and he's doing something. He's being a cat. Hey, what are you doing? He's like 14 years old. He's going to die soon, guys. Be nice to him. <laughs> he cats. He was very cuddly today. And Star Trek Beyond was awesome. Oh, Beyond was so good. Loved Beyond. Anyway, that's all I got on Star Trek. Lower Decks is an amazing show. I guess that's really what I'm trying to say. Was that was that roundabout? Well, you weren't really commentary. And, was... and you're going through a volcano. Nothing super interesting is happening I right mean, now. I'm walking on lava. I'm walking on lava. I'm 40% ah. dolomite. <laughs> is Seymour in here? 
Oh no. I see Ween. <laughs> I see Ween. Our future home great show too. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Do it. Kill you know, them. You know what one of the best. You know one of the best episodes of Future Hours? What? The Star Trek episode. Actually, yes. It's so good. It's so good. Well, she. <laughs> you know. I could have just not explored all of that, and I would have been fine. Yeah, but then you wouldn't be in an RPG. I don't I, think you're quite understanding JRPGs yet. What are you thinking of JRPGs? We haven't really had this conversation. Um, well, right now... This is a very basic bitch JRPG. This was, like, the first party-based one. Yeah, and 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 I am enjoying myself mostly because we get to sit and uh, now... Ooh, I got a gold needle. Uh, and Monsters! And drink and play video games uh, now recording it instead of just doing it like we would have done. See, I'm, I'm going to just kind of say wait it out until three. Three doesn't have like... Ooh, ooh I got to think. Field, field research, research advanced. advanced. That's for killing monsters. Yep. Um, three doesn't have the most compelling story, but it's got a story. And the, the job system is really cool. Four has a great story. Um... Five has a gr has what? Oh, they both ran away. Five has like, a story. Damn, Olivia! Five actually has a pretty good story, and five has an amazing job system. Hey, Chris, what do you bet this is monsters? Oh, <gasps> it wasn't. Rip. It was just money. And six is probably my favorite Final Fantasy of all time. I love that game so much. I'm looking at the. Oh, there's a room over there. There is a room over there. All right, all right. That's a reason enough to go up there. Ow, 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 Look at this guy. I, these guys are looking at me like... These guys are, mm. these guys are fashionable. That I, I, I feel like they're, they're, they're kind of giving me like the, the Zoolander. They're like... Wait, mm. look at those bulging ripples. Mm. Bulging, mm. bulging ripples is a trademark of uh, the Tony Entertainment. <laughs> also, brush food. Remember brush food? Brush food. We talked about it the other day from everybody else's perspective. Antidote. Monsters! So... These used to be trap tiles instead of being monsters in a chest. Okay. The tile in front of it was always a guaranteed encounter with this particular monster. Ah. So if you stepped off it and on it, off it and on it, off it, you keep fighting the same monster. Oh, you could just, you so you could actually farm them for experience if there was a particularly good experience monster there. Let's see. What are we betting? Monsters, treasures. Monsters, treasures. Monsters! Did you ever look at the equipment you got in the armory? The mithril stuff? Yeah. I actually had bought most of that already. Oh, did so. you? So. I mean, I might see if the shield does red any good, but um, you know what? I will take a moment. Well, I got, got flame, flame shield. shield. Let's see how that what that does. Um, you know, I they I don't know if they changed the custom. I think flame shield makes you strong against ice. Let's see. It says I should go with flame shield. Okay. Go go to it. Go to the description of it. You give people an, an optimal. People don't know. Let's see. Mithril did this. We don't care about this screen. Go back. Go flame shield. Hit the X button. Well, the other X button. It's actually the square for it program. Yeah, it's a shield. Oh, you give him the mithril shield. Get the get the flame shield on. What are you doing? It's there a we go. shield. Give me the power that guards against ice. But nobody really is fighting with ice right now. But somebody's gonna fight. Well, you gave me the okay. I'm big dumb dumb. I'm pretty. You just you don't get the tropes of this genre yet. I don't. Don't, and he can't carry a shield, right? Uh, I don't know. Hit the button. There you go. Nope. Now you, now you nope. know. Why are you asking me? I actually know the answer, but why are you I, asking me? Because I, I, I trust. You're, you're one button away from having the answer to your questions, and you're just like, ah, I'm going to ask instead. I want, I want to know what you. You know, think. you have nothing better. It's descending order of usefulness. Oh. Nope. That's I'm. I meant to. Okay. Cutie Pie absolutely is. Ah, oh, my ice have melted. Now the whiskey burns. <laughs> Burned into my nose where I already had hot spices. Because I had hot spices up my nose earlier. Yeah, Chris almost died. I was sipping we started. Some, I was sipping some spicy broth and there was a piece of broccoli hiding in it that I didn't see. And that went right to the back of my throat, which led way too much broth to go into my mouth, which led it up my nasal cavity and I was smelling spice. It was cool. 10 out of 10 would do again. I mean, I've seen you pay to do that, so. All right, all right, all right. Ooh, ice brand. Whatever that does. 
And some money. Let's it's, a, it's a sword. You're a sword. Okay. Ooh. Hit the square button. The power of I. I'm gonna go with it. So what do you think that's gonna be useful? I got ices and shields. I don't know how we can hear my whispering. Probably not. It might sound like incoherent muttering. I mean. The, the and we're back in the volcano. Ah! Uh, I can we just casually walk through lava, by the way. Here we go. That's not a. That's a cow. That is a cow. I've always I thought that. Worry about, about what the Asian, the Japanese artists thought when they made this. They were well, like, you know, "That looks like a dog." So my grandfather used to raise dogs. Yeah. He's dead now. Yep. So were all the dogs he ever raised. Wow. Well, they are. I mean, he's been dead. Many, much years. Almost 20 years. Mm -hmm. Which means those dogs are definitely dead. Yeah. Even, even the last ones that are there. I never realized when I was a kid, the casual racism that got thrown out uh, by my grandfather. It was actually very disappointing to hear. Um, if that was up. You got, you got a room over there to the right. Yep. So the casual... Did you go in that room yet? You didn't go in that room yet. Hit yeah. it all the way back. You just, like, double, you just double back all the time. I do. So he once sold a dog that he bred to Korea and made nonstop jokes about how they were just going to eat the dog instead of anything else. And I, I didn't realize at the time how racist that was. As I grew up, I'm like, damn, Grandpa, that was racist. Yeah, that, that probably wasn't the best joke to have. So that story was a combination story. Maybe do a combination of both don't eat the dogs, but also don't judge people who eat dogs because that's their culture. Yeah. And two, don't be racist towards Koreans. They're that's delightful people. Who keep giving us international sensations for everybody to watch. That's right, K-pop's a thing. Well, and also the new Squid Game is... I'm largely unfamiliar with K-pop. I've been hearing about the Squid Game. What is the Squid Game? I. It's a movie. It's a movie? It's a movie. Or a show. It's either a movie or a show. But it sounds like it's a game, because it's the, it's the, it's the squid game. Uh, yes, because nothing has ever... Money! Cottage! Alright, I got another cottage. Sweet, 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 sweet. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, 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 cool. Hell cows! <laughs> they really do look like demonic cows that the, are coming These for are me. the cows that the Burger King used for the Angry Whopper. You guys remember the Angry Whopper? And the Angry Whopper is still a thing. It dude. is not still a thing. It did is. it come back? Because it was off the menu for a while. Um, then I, they did the Angriest Whopper. The angriest. Where didn't the commercial like the farmer physically assault an onion? I think so, yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. That was a weird commercial. I mean, it was probably All commercials not. Were, I haven't really seen most commercials in my life anymore because we stream everything now. It was really weird. So So you're going to have an Agama here. I don't uh, know, it's still called an Agama. Agama. 351 damage. That's what I'm talking about. Boom. Show off, Olivia. See, I remember I told you monks just get stronger bare hands. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Red, that's quite the... And look at look at Red just 12 in a leg. And now Reed's on a third grade level. <laughs> oh, Van Jackman. You... <laughs> Pit. Ben Jackman has been the disappointment. Now, there is some RNG. These are not preset numbers. There's some RNG in building the numbers. Monster! Oh, they're calling it Fire Lizard. They used to be called an Agama. I like his little hairstyle. His little foof. His little foof. Boo, boo, pew. Me, me, mm, Got some money. Mm, mm, mm. Monsters. Monsters, 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 monsters. So this is the Agama tiles. that used to be ben the two Jackman. tiles next to this. And you could just level up like crazy, just stepping up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Olivia, how'd that go? Ooh. Not bad. Not great. Hey. Hey. And I got a staff. So somebody can run and get your coffee, somebody can make your copies. Uh. Guys, that was an office humor joke. Yes, that was. I've never worked in an office in my life. Yeah, I know. I don't know what that was all about. I've done a number of things. I was a teacher. Yeah. I was a automotive store manager, and now I am a construction project manager, but I've never worked in an office. I've had an office I went to on occasion, but I've never worked in an office in my life. Yeah. yeah. It's the truthiness. How else am like me, who has worked in all of the offices? When you don't work in an office, 
you're like, oh man, those people need to get to work in the office and you know their job is much less demanding and they get the AC all day. When you do work in an office, you're like, I'm jealous of you guys in the field who get to get to do stuff all day. Yeah. Yeah, that actually pretty much is how that, that goes down. Uh, and of course, uh, the, the ladies in the office all being mad because none of the people out in the field are doing what they're supposed to because they have never... We're doing exactly what we're supposed to. Y'all just don't know what you're talking about. You don't know the realities of being in the field, okay? And, and if y'all can't tell, Chris and I actually briefly worked in the same industry. And Bree's wrong about everything she says in it. I, she doesn't get it. Apparently. Office people are peons. Look at this room. Look at this effing room. What? Oh, what? Stop. Open up your thing. What? Open up your menu. What hellscape so, abomination? So you've got doors everywhere. There's a door. There's a door over there. There's I'll, a door over I'll there. I'll help you. I'll help you. The, door there. The lower left door is the end of the dungeon. Okay, so I want to go hit all of these. So maybe go down and then just hit all of them counterclockwise. Now, don't forget, you have a speed button. Now hold down next to move a little faster because that's what the people want. Be the people's champion, Bree. Bree, be the people's champion. Bree. Bree, the people's champion. Bree. <laughs> you, can, you can keep whispering sweet nothings in my ear, but, uh... No, don't blink, don't blink, don't blink! Strawberry flavored nothing. That's a sweet nothing. That is a sweet nothing. Yes. Are you going to be the people's champion? Be the people's, be the people's champion. I have to... Okay, that, that's... Oh, uh, yeah! Whoa, look at you. Oh, there's nothing here. Oh. Minotaur! I will crown you the people's champion. No! I don't want that bull on my head. I'm going to eat a mushroom. We made stuffed mushrooms the other day, guys. They were really good, but they needed to be spicy. I tried to actually put a little bit of spice in them, but I also remembered that I was cooking for a seven-year-old who, if anything, is even remotely spicy. Look, it's a red dagron. Dagron! Oh! Ow! Oh! Dar you, you dragon. You should kill him expeditiously. Dragon. Dragon. That wasn't cool. Dragon. You know what? Maybe we'll do this. Use those basic cure spells. Don't yep. forget stuff. Oh yeah, you have a command forget. You forget that. Okay. Okay. I now, I, now I don't know math. Huh. I like how you're like I've healed good enough. I That's put... all your spells. Yep. <sighs> so notice how you have level six and level seven spell slots. You just can't use them yet. I noticed that. Actually, you got all the way up to level eight spell slots with Cutie Pie. Mm. All right, all right, all right. right. Yeah, it is. You guess that, that? That sounds awful. Run, 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 run. Yeah. Ogre chefs. That's that's not, but that says it all. That's an ogre chief. Ah, with the Blizzara. Oh, they're all asleep. Oh, they no. got you all! Oh, oh, you woke up and punched me in the face. I mean, and then you ran away. That's the thing. That's the thing that happened. Yep. Choppy choppy. That was ridiculous what happened there. Everybody was falling asleep. And... Yes, geez. but then Olivia woke up and she was like, everybody's kung fu fighting. Oh, why? Why? That, that was... That was definitive what they just did there. I'm real proud of everybody, actually. That was worth it. That was worth the walk. That was not worth the walk. In what way was that not worth the walk? Oh, fire elementals. You know what they don't like? Being punched in the face with a sword. But it's a sword. See? They don't like being punched in the face with a sword. And you've made two of the eight branching paths. Oh, this one's the easy one to get to. Yep. Again, the elementals, all up in my elemental way. Chop, 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 chop. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, 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 chop. I wish you could, like, rest in the dungeon. Wow. 
Got another potion. By the way, we said it. Muppet Haunted Mansion. Go watch it. Yeah. It was super cute. Um, and as, you know, as long as you can forgive the fact that Kermit does not sound... Ooh, I got a knife! Stabby, stabby. Kermit hasn't sounded like Kermit for a long time, so really, Kermit does sound like Kermit. No, no, Kermit doesn't. I I know... Ogre Chefs! I know that Brian Henson has been doing it for a long time now. Brian Henson was not Kermit in this movie. I know, well, the he other guy... He was not guy. Kermit in the last several things the Muppets did. This is, this whole, this, this sleep thing is not going well. Guys, come on. We're tired. Punch people. Thank you. So this is going to be a long episode. Yeah, I apologize. Well, it's not like anybody watches these all the way through anyways. Or at all. Okay. Actually, I saw one of our analytics. It's like 10% or less of people watch it all the way to the end. So if you watch this far. Thanks. Comment with the secret password. And I'll send you one thousand dollars. No, he won't. Well, I wasn't gonna leave a password. I'm, I'm more like, please don't put that we're gonna give anybody a thousand dollars. I put my thousand dollars into crypto these days. Yeah. Oh, you're one of those guys. Nah, no, I just put it in. And I make money off it. I made like forty thousand dollars off dog coin this year. That was pretty cool. We're still not sure exactly how that all went down. Uh, it's it feels not legal. <laughs> it really does. Like, I know we put aside the money for taxes, and I know everything was legal, and I know we've spent the rest of the money on cool stuff, but it doesn't feel like it ever actually happened. Yeah, it's like we, things, something. Ugh. We bought in, and three months later, we had 40 grand extra. I don't know what happened. It was the weirdest thing. I like that every time I, I step into one of the corner ones, I immediately. Immediately? Immediately. Ooh, I gotta level up. Let's see how everybody did. I mean... I Garbage. That one's not bad. Uh, finally, some HP. Still not breaking 300 there. No, no, it needs... Frickin' Van Jackman. Desperately does need to. That's the worst. Oh, it's empty. Wah, wah. Don't you... I probably do want to heal. Do-do-do-do. Do-do-do-do-do. Time to heal, cause it really hurts now. I think Cutie Pie kind of looks like Batman. Take a look at that at the bottom. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. With one ear. I'm one ear Batman. They call me what, man? Everybody feeling better. Cause that's the way we roll. Do you wish you brought more high potions? I do now. Yep. I, I won't lie. I mean, you haven't used them all, but do you wish you had more? I do. A lizard. Fur little flurs lizard. Who will have you got that level up? What'd you get? What'd you get? What? Uh, Meh. 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 Moving on. Moving on. Moving on. But I, I like that I just come up to these guys and I'm like, Hey, what are you doing down here, too? Hey, you want to fight lizard in a trench coat? That's <laughs> oh. what he was. Cutie pie, what do you get? What do you get? What do you get? Uh, Nothing. <laughs> hot garbage. Nothing great. Monsters. Monsters. Oh, that's a dragon. Dragon? It is a dragon. How did I know that? Dagrons. I ain't no drag wrong. He mm. hits for 230, man. Flame mail. Oh, I wonder what flame mail will do for me. Mm, no. Mm. 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 Um, use the power of fire. That's God's advice. It does. Up my invasion. Is it There's invasion? no reason not to put it on. Up upgrade your invasion. Uh, invasion. Your invasion. Well, you're <laughs> invading right now. Upgrade yeah. your evasion by a lot. Okay. But I can't give anybody else the knight's uniform. Nah. Screw those guys. Because apparently I don't believe in helping out my teammates. Mino Tower. Mentors! Mino Mentors! Mino Towers. Mino Towers. It's, Mino a, towers. it's, a, it's a tower of fish. <laughs> tower of tiny fish. Tiny, tiny fish. Yep. 
Yep, that's. Yee. Nope. So after this fight, you may want to make sure you are well rested. Yep, that's kind of what I was thinking. But why were you thinking that? Because this looks like it might be the end of the, the, the thing with the stuff and the, the things. The thing and the stuff, you say? Mm -hmm. The hell are you mm -hmm. saying? Oh, hey, Loki. He's still a cat. He hasn't changed into a not cat. Yay. What? Actually, I'm okay. Okay. Um, I'm probably going to give... Nope. Not the expert. Yeah, don't waste that expert. You want to save that for later. I'm going to give... You want to be that player who saves things for later, but then never actually uses them. That's me. That's, that is literally me. Because later never comes. Ooh, I found it! Who am I going to fight? So, so you, you are the ones who defeated the fiend of Earth and roused Marlith from her slumber. Mm -hmm. Here it comes. The ball's going to become... Ibri. Yeah. Now two balls have exploded. Power of the burning flame is mine and mine alone. Those who oppose me shall burn in hellfire. Oh. That's extreme. It's time for murdering. I'm betting. She is vulnerable to being confused. Although I don't have any confused spells. I don't think I you do. You should try to kill her. Use death. You haven't used death yet. Magic. Um, he's gonna try. Well, you can haste your uh, team. I could haste my team. <laughs> we'll haste. Yeah. And. Do I cast death? Ta nope. Do I cast death? I'm going to cast that. It's probably not it probably won't work on her, but definitely do it against the Fiend of Water, because it actually works surprisingly a lot. Eight attacks. That was good. Five attacks. That was great. Not great. Death. Missed. Ace. Yeah, it's a boss monster. She's probably like a very low percentage of being death, death. But you still got haste you can cast on Olivia. You still got temper. And you still got, I think you have Blizzaga on Cutie Pie. Uh, Patrick. He does not have Blizzaga, but he has Blizzara. I mean, that's better than no dog. He blizz, blizzes. Yep, blizzes. Oh! 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 Yeah, Carrie hits like a Mack truck. Yeah, she died. That hurt. 16. Oh, well, that was terrible. That wasn't terrible. So he definitely got some crits off. You have a uh, Kiraga still. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna use that. And where are we at, Bree? You gotta comment at the episode here. I'm I'm trying to decide. Nope, not that. What magic? What magic's next? What if we try Scourge? I mean. Or Thundaga. 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 That's not great. Don't, don't. Okay, well, at least I feel better. Ten hits? That really, really red. Oh. 107. Oh. All that, all that thinking and, and... I mean, they need temper on their weapons is what they need. Where did I put temper? There it is. Temper. There. And more magic. We'll do, uh... Quaker. Yeah, let's try Quake. It's not going to work, but it's fine. Alright, we can... You never... Nope. 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 Because why should... Oh, finally! Yay! Oh, what a world! What a world! I'm melting into pixels! And ah. that's the end of care. I don't want to go, Mr. Stark. <laughs> Alright. Alright. We're going to put up our crystal. We're going to show, woo, yeah, light up that red crystal. Everybody's feeling good. We all went, woo. And now we're going to come right here. Rekindled Ooh. flame. Leave? Why, yes. Yes, I am. I love, I'm going to make like a tree and get out of here. All right. So we have made it out of Mount Gold. Woo! 
Uh, Bree has no idea where to go next, but there are two more continents to discover in the world. I'm going to go back to that other place. One of them looks like a fat chicken. The one on the upper right there. Burr, burr. Anyway, thank you for watching uh, episode 11 of Bree Plays Final Fantasy Pixel Remaster. Uh, like and subscribe for more content. Hit the bell button for notifications. Leave us a comment. And uh, yeah, have a have a good gaming night. And don't uh, don't don't cast death on Carrie. I mean Marilith, That's her name in this version. Yeah, Marilith, Don't don't cast death. It didn't. It didn't. Or quake, for that matter. But thanks. Bye.